Yeah, we are today we are going to make a spanner using 3D modeling. Starting with solid part. Before going anything further, we are just saving the file at the location so we can save it rapidly while doing the work. So the location of the select the desired location and save the part. So initially I am going to make the two ends of the panel. The Handle between those two ends will make it later on. Starting with sketch. We are giving the dimensions of the two ends of the spanner according to the drawing. You can see here 100 mm apart and this R16, R that means the dia 32 and one another R15 that means dia 30. We are given those dimensions. Further development we are going to make and those cut in the sketch. Here you can see the 17 degree angle and 17 mm gap and here 13 mm gap. To make that, I'm using the legs. I'm using connect command. I'm taking this midpoint to the center of the circle. And I'm using perpendicular contain to make these things perpendicular. For the extra things, we remove the trains. And here also, we remove the trains. Since you can see this one is schemes way further in the inset, even though we didn't give the dimensions, approximately we are doing these dimensions. And using constraint, I'm changing this into a for preference for the following. In between, as a 17 degree, you can see you see earlier in the drawing 17 degree. I'm doing that again. I'm going to do the camera. In between this R13 we want to make using that one with three arc arc by three points or arc by tangent will suffice, but we are using arc by three points. Start point of the arc with the end point of the arc and in between. You can really check this area of this software. You can see what are the next command you want to do it. So while reading this one, you can make it easily. Now we are giving a dimension to that one. So accordingly, this one is R13. We are giving R. 13 to that one. Even though this dimension we will never get, but we are giving approximately one dimension in between those two lines. We are giving 17 here. So this and of this 
the same way we want to make the other end of this spanner same same procedure we are going to do here one line another one line one line out this one we are using for the reference purpose only and same midpoint we are using for particular commands to name this one absolutely correct Still in command to trim the failure. And you can see this one is 13 ml. It's changing this dimension. This is also 13 ml. But uh, when you look at it, this is more than 30. I'm giving a 15 or 16 ml here. So instead of 13, I'm changing to 16 ml. And I'm changing those unwanted lines to construction lines. But those are really called as a rough line. Mm -hmm. And Again, you can see what switching the degree as I showed here, that is similar as the 17 degree. So, I'm doing those in the same degree as lights. Okay. Yeah. You want to make a R9 of here in between. Same, I'm using a pretty good R. So you, if you read here, you can see, click the start point of the arc. I'm clicking the start point of the arc. Click the end point of the arc. I'm clicking end point of the arc. And click the point on the arc. And we are giving it a motion from this arc. This R9. You can see R9 has been set. So initially we made the two ends of the this thing so this is option for this way and all done mm -hmm. and finish so using this sketch command you can do the process select the sketch chain on the both side and click ok using symmetric and giving a 4 mm of thick, uh, thickness or 5 mm thickness i'm giving even though the thickness is not given, I'm just giving the five on thickness and clicking finish. Now we have the both ends of the spanner. We want to make a handle in between of 11 mm thickness. To do that, I'm using again protrusion command. I'm using here directly because that is not recorded in one detailed big sketch. So I'm just using the protrusion command. I'm selecting on constant plane and selecting the plane using a rectangle tool and making I'm making the rectangle what we required again using the current command here in between as never ML I'm trying to do the property and I need here once okay I think it's okay and so never ML yes anything that so the point is from to here again cut this point to here so to be set up, same kind of point here to here. So this is to be equally better. So 
even though this is not showing any further details, we can still make up to this one already. So, and I'm just I'm done. And here we can see change to simple questions. And we given three amount on the both heads of the panel. Here in handle we don't record the three amount. Uh, five amount, we just doing the three amount. And finish. We made a handle here. Here we want to see you can see R47 and R23 fillet can be shown here. So the most we are making. Making those billet or command set about first one is R47. Giving command 47. Same way we want to make a fillet on this other side. It is R23. Command. Start with the dancing part. Here we give our dancing part. Okay. And choosing the edges or the corners. Selected and finish. Review and finish. This will be from the end of the And sketches. Now you can see the span has been made. After the dimensions, this is the spanner we will go and we save in the car. file. After that, we file, save as save the same file as a still file document for the further development of the property. For the conversion, we change it to 0 0.025 tolerance conversion tolerance as millimeters and surface plane angle as 45 degree output file as asking. Click OK and same.